transferring your existing jobs from all-in-one version 2 to all-in-one version 3 is a simple two-step process. The process begins in all-in-one version 2 where you will choose those jobs to be exported. You may accomplish this task using either of two methods. Method 1 involves the import-export command at the top of the screen, which guides you through the process. Clicking the Import-Export button launches the Import-Export window. From here, click the All-in-One to All-in-One option. Next, click the Export Radio button. And then, choose a destination for the XML files that will be exported. Make sure you choose a memorable location because you will need to locate your files later when importing to All-in-One version 3. From here, you may export either all jobs and contacts or selected jobs. Using the Selected Jobs option, simply choose the jobs you wish to export. Use the bottom buttons to choose All Jobs or use the top buttons to choose Selected Jobs. Once you've chosen the jobs to be exported, click Export. A dialog box displays to confirm that your jobs have successfully exported. Method 2 involves selecting and exporting jobs directly from the job board. To export these jobs, right-click on your mouse and choose Export to File. You are once again prompted to choose a location in which to save the XML file. Make sure you save your files to a memorable location. You will need to locate them later when importing to All-in-One version 3. The next and final step in the process is to import your jobs into All-in-One version 3. Clicking the Import button either on the File tab or in the Getting Started section of the screen launches Windows Explorer, which prompts you to select the job to be imported. Note that a single XML file may contain one or several jobs. In either case, you are prompted to select one job to import. In other words, All-in-One version 3 will import one job at a time in an effort to protect the integrity of your files. Once you've selected a job to import, click Import. A dialog box displays to confirm that your project has successfully imported to All-in-One version 3. In some cases, the pricing on a job will need to be updated. Clicking Save Report enables you to maintain an audit trail for your customer. Once you've saved the report, click Done. This will apply the updated pricing to all affected items on the schedule. Important to note is that any future edits made to a project will only be saved in the version of the software in which they are made. For example, if you were to go back to All-in-One version 2 and make changes to this job, those changes would not automatically be carried forward to All-in-One version 3. In that case, you would have to re-import the updated job.